Today's video is brought to you by OldSchoolGaming.net, the online resource for all your tabletop gaming needs. At OldSchoolGaming.net, customers get store credit with every purchase. Great prices, fast shipping, and customer rewards. OldSchoolGaming.net Hey guys, I'm TG Noob here. Uh, I'm going to keep this hand, I believe, on the uh, do, 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 on the draw, but it needs it needs a little help. Um, we should hit a blue source though, so I'm not gonna mull mull this. Well, we'll see. I mean, we can definitely get punished by never hitting a blue source, but looks like we're against either Boros or Rizab. Oh, Dinrovahar, that's awesome. That's exactly what we wanted. That's a blue and a black card. Just what we want. What? Just what the doctor ordered. All right. So now we're against the uh. Boros deck that's real, I guess you can say. Um, hopefully, we take it down. We're definitely blocking. Nothing else we could really do here. If he goes all in on his combat, then we blow it up on his next turn. Yep, you do your thing. Play your Martial Glory. Wow, alright, you want to clear the way. That's fine. Maybe he's got a Jack or something. Hopefully, he had a Blue Source. That's pretty good. Ugh, yuck. Yuck, yuck, yuck. I don't want him to be able to save that. Tapping my stuff down is annoying as well, but, you know, it, it's potential that was pretty fast, especially if he plays something here that we can't deal with. Like, that's fine. All right, come on, something. Uh this deck, man, this deck. This deck has just decided to hate us. And an app squad, sure. And we need a land and a grizzly spectacle in our next draw. Alright, come on. Come on, blue source. We're not dead, but this is unfortunate that we've drawn one swamp and all blue cards. <clears throat> give it a turn. We'll give it a turn. Give it one more turn. Okay, you got it. I can't come back from that. Okay, so quickly getting our butt kicked by Boros. Uh, I think that's too slow, even though it's on the draw. Where is our lands? Maybe that was just such a loose keep, but a two drop and a removal spell against an unknown opponent in this format seems pretty decent. But, oh man. We can bring these two things in, but not really in love with that. I think we're going to run this back, although this is really bad against Boros. <clears throat> he did show us a 2-1, which maybe this comes in. I think we bring in the, the Slate Street Ruffian over maybe the Bomb and the, the Lord of the Void, but like these, like this plan against Boros isn't technically a very good one, but our deck is just very underpowered then. Um... Like we could bring this in and, and a spell rupture maybe, but the, the, those both seem pretty bad. I think we bring in the Slate Street Ruffian. It's just a matter of do we take out the mine grind or do we take out this? I think we take out the mine grind. Sorry guys, I don't think we can be true to our colors against a straight Boros deck. Eh, this is pretty good. Of course, the seven drop decides to be in our hand, but sometimes seven drops show up. Sometimes they just want to be in your hand. Seven drops like you sometimes. What can I say? All right, that's good. All the land. Just give me all the land. I will kill that sorcery. Don't you play a sorcery on me right now. I'll kill it. That is insta-dead. Insta-dead. The thing is, he must have something else that's really good. You never, like, run out your guild mage there, I don't think. At least my opinion. My opinion's trash, so who knows. Just like you don't <laughs> run this guy out without being able to protect him. Hopefully he was all in on that uh, Sunhold Gil Mage. I think we could bash. There's nothing on the ground that hastes, so... 
See what happens when the deck has lands? Nothing. We drop a Lord of the Void turn 7 and pray that you don't Angelic Edict us. I think getting an extorter is just fine. Fine, just fine. I think uh, Lazav is doing work this game here. I'm not going to be blocking, though. <clears throat> I mean, having a 2-4 against his 2-3 is, is nice, but I don't think I could be blocking against that. All right, Lord of the Void, you can't get Angelic Edict. You just can't. So... We gotta hope. Madcap skills. 6 3. I'm gonna take it once. <clears throat> I can't lose both my guys here. We also could rip into one of our Dinrova horrors and just be super stoked about it. Or we can rip into nothing. And we might be in trouble. <clears throat> we might be in trouble here. Alright, on our turn, I guess we have to block. We can possibly take it one more time, but I don't really want to do that. Hit me, baby, one more time. Swung last time. Ugh. I'm gonna take it. I don't think he can kill us from there. We have so much removal in the form of everything in our deck is live. Every removal spell in our deck is live, so. And then again. <clears throat> Apparently, Lord of the Void is going to die. I think we're dead. We'll see how he attacks. Because if he goes with both, then we may be dead to a blood rush on this. I think I unfortunately have to block with Lord of the Void on this. <clears throat> but then we're just kind of screwed. Fire fist, sure. Sure thing. We got a top deck here. We have got two top deck. He's got a good deck. Maybe the Lazav play was too techy, but I thought a 2-4 against him would be really kind of strong. <clears throat> I mean, he's setting up kill next turn, so we have to, like, this isn't going to be able to block, I would assume. Oh, he's setting up kill this turn. Okay. Alright, we need a top deck. We go to one. Alright, come on, top deck. Oh, that's so good. So good. All 
All right. The thing is, I'm almost certain he's got a haster here. Almost certain. Which means this is just. Uh, this doesn't allow to get. <laughs> this isn't allowed to get madcap skills. We got an armor transport. No thanks. No. Now, we have two lines here. One, we can just hold back with Lord of Void and then just die to this. Or two, we could potentially hope to swing. He doesn't block because that's his out. Um, and then we hit a flyer. But I think either way... I don't think I could attack with this. I think we're just dead to a hasty creature here, to be perfectly honest. He played well. His deck's really nice. He's a good player. I can't hate on him. Hit me, bro. Hit me. <clears throat> Haste away. We gotta we gotta rip. <laughs> Grizzly spectacle does not kill this. Alright. So apparently it's not a hasty creature, but it does block the shit out of us. Alright, we need a flyer or a removal spell. That's neither. <sighs> Alright, well we have to well we'll go to three. Which isn't actually the worst. I'm going to do this and this, I believe. Three blockers. This one can No. I got to keep him back. See if we get anything here. Oh, totally put this into play. Syndic would be good, but I think we want another flyer. Alright, well, we've got the ground shored up. That's for certain. It's just a matter of if he can make this not block and pump this, we're still screwed. But I don't think I can not do that. Since he didn't have it last time, he just played out a Thunder Fist. Um, so he's got to have... Yep, I think he's got it if he swings. Alright, well, show me anything! <laughs> show me anything! <laughs> show me anything! I guess maybe we could have... Um, milled some stuff out. Maybe this actually turns into something. Okay, well that was good. That was a play I didn't think would even happen. <laughs> Alright. Block. 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 Okay, we'll see if we're still in this. I don't know why I didn't give this vigilance. See what's happening here. See what's happening. See what's happening. Tempted to try to flip off uh, the Lazav again, but I gotta kill what I can kill. 
We'll pass priority and see what happens. All right, our opponent scoops. Yay, scoopage. All right, well, ugh, yuck. Bah, yuck. Lord of the Void, I'm glad that you stayed around for that wild ride. I sadly think I might need this. I mean, get Fire Fist, the 2-1 Goblin. <clears throat> Can we side in more removal, <laughs> please? <laughs> I'd like to uh, side in Spell Rupture, but I don't think that's an option. I think we just run this back with Mind Grind still in the board. Shadow Lane might need to come in, but I can't see anything I really want to take out. So let's run this back. Good luck, opponent. We got lucky there because I did not see that interaction, hence why I am the MTG noob. I will keep, and I will hope that it gets there. Town Glare is good. We have to save certain things, like... This is reserved for Sunholm Guild Mage. Or something of that nature. Okay, we hit our black source. That's good. Don't play a zero toughness guy. Don't play a zero toughness guy. Alright, I'm going to play Island because I want to pretend I have Demir Charm. Our opponent did Mulda 5 and kept. <clears throat> We're going to get the pressure on. No sense in sitting back here against an aggressive deck. I'm probably killing Larry in that. <clears throat> I don't think I need to kill and glare that, honestly. I think currently we're we're the beat down. We are the beat down. It's when he gets like multiple two twos in play that we're in trouble. Sure. I'll allow him to do that. Because it gets it out of his hand. And then we'll just mill him. Mill away those lands. Okay, Marshall Glory Ember Beast land. Say okay. <clears throat> okay, and when you give us a few turn advantage with this deck. Things are looking good. Okay, so he's back in this land wise, that is. Currently, don't think we're winning this race, so I'm just going to play the blocking game <clears throat> where I block and then kill and glare this. Um, we also might want to Grizzly Spectacle it if it gets large enough. This is fine. I accept. Okay, I actually want to hold my removal. The reason I want to hold my removal is because we're not... We're going to lose to certain cards and we're not going to lose to this card at 20 life. Especially since we're one land away from a 7 drop. Like, if he swings here, I'm just going to block and trade. And then I'll just kill and glare, or sack it out. Here's another one. And we're kind of in trouble. Armor transport's fine. I block that all day.
Well, we'll see what happens here. Because I'm going to be killing this and then doing stuff. I will not be blocking, although it is unlikely that any combination kills Lord of Void. With the Goblin Haster and another Martial Glory, he can actually trade, so I'm not going to be blocking here. <clears throat> see what this is. Okay, except I just block. Yep, you got me. You got me. Okay. We will say okay. Oh, sweet Jesus. Let's put an Aurelia into play. Let us put an Aurelia into play. Well, you made out. You got an Aurelia. Sweet Jesus. That's That's got to be G to the G. This plus this. Yeah. All right. Well, we're loving that. We are loving taking things down with a Demir deck. All right, so I hope you enjoyed that. We played to the best of my ability, threw a few forks on the floor, and I hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Please check out the mtgnoob.com.